You know what? I will keep our Kazuhaman in and let's see how we will do against your ace monster, Cyber and Dragon. And he looks glorious at level 40. So, let's start by using Air Slash. Or not. And welcome back to our new part of Yu-Gi-Oh! Poke Duel. When we last left off, we defeated the Fighting Dojo here at Saffron City, and we're about to enter Silfco in order to challenge our rival and Giovanni. Uh, but I think they are going to be very high leveled, uh, maybe level 40 is going to be required in order to challenge them. So you know what, I think I will face all the trainers here at Silfco first in order to gain the experience points, and if that's not enough, we still have the trainers around Fushia City that we skipped. And that Cycling Road too, uh, we didn't face any of them. Um, so yeah, I think level 40 is gonna be the level we have to, up to obtain in order to uh, challenge our rival. <laughs> I was totally ready for your encounter, kind sir, but he looked the other way. He's afraid. <laughs> now let's see if this guy is afraid. No, he's not. I heard the kid was wandering around. Yeah, but not any kid, sir. It's Dawn. The protagonist of Yu-Gi-Oh! Poke Duel. Illusion Magician. Alright. Um, our XY Dragon is about to level up, so you know what? I will give you to our Elena, kind sir, in order to give her some experience points. Yep, it's super effective and deals a decent amount of damage. What is that? Ouch. That hurt, kind sir. Okay, uh, the shell bell restored the HP a little bit. <laughs> I totally forgot that I gave you that, Elena. But it, it came in handy, so that's awesome. And despite the level difference, you were able to take down Illusion Magician. Awesome work, Elena. Boom! Yeah, our Elena is uh, becoming a, quite the quite the rival here. Uh, card key, all right. So, I I'm not familiar with ghost types except Haunter from very long ago, so being able to use her super effective uh, ghost move against psychic types is gonna be uh, something of uh, value. Show Team Rocket a little respect. Why? You steal other people's Pokémon, sir, or dual monsters. Twin Thunder Dragon. Hello there, kind sir! <laughs> And you have Volt Absorb, so that makes sense. What can I use against you, kind sir? Uh, maybe 3 days grace will deal a lot of damage? So, let's hit the field! Okay, Rock's Light next. And it deals super effective damage, more than half your health, kind sir, that's awesome. Oh, but this this one misses, come on. And it misses again. Okay, this one does not miss, so thank you, three days grace. And XY Dragon levels up to level 35. <coughs> yeah. You were about to say something, but I made you swallow your words, kind sir. So now that we have the card key, uh, let me explore um, this room. I think we have an item. Yes, we do. Focus Punch. Um, it's not a good fighting move. 
Speaking of which, um, do I need a... I have Brick Break. Protein, okay, but I don't think anyone in our team currently can learn it. So... I will definitely give it to someone, but uh, we don't have anyone in our team at the moment who can learn it. Quit messing with us, kid. Well, make me kind, sir. Let's see what you've got. This Feral Imp. Okay, it's not very effective, but deals a decent amount of damage, and he's tickling us! <laughs> How nice of you, kind sir! Okay, hit three times, that is not paralyzed not a single time. So, Thundershock was enough to take you down. Thank you for coming, Desferal Imp. Illusion Magician. So, I think I will give this to our Elena. And the Shell Bell continues to restore Elena's health, so that is awesome, actually. Yeah, use Light Screen, kind sir. Use whatever you can. Sword Stalker. So definitely not Elena, but who do I give it to? Um, can our Alexis handle Sword Stalker? Let's try it out. I mean, after this encounter, we have like one more encounter, and then we unlock the nurse here at Silfco, so we can uh, take him on. Let's try Ice Punch. We have Ice Punch and Quick Attack. Those are our best moves here. Wow, that didn't deal a lot of damage at all. Okay, neither did that. And he has Moonlight. So you know what, Sword Stalker? Um, you have earned an audience with our ace monster, the Dark Slayer, Kazuhaman. Yeah, because our uh, Alexis is not gonna be able to take you down here, no way. Oh, and you have Ember! Okay, that would have been disastrous for our uh, Alexis. Thankfully, our Kuzuhamon can tank it, so... Yeah, you go down in two. Awesome work, Kuzuhamon. I give up! Yes, sir! Uh, so this one takes us to our rival. The next one will take us to the nurse. Hyper Potion. That's a very nice find. And we have to face you, kind sir. Your Pokemon seem to adore you, kid. Well, that's very high praise, especially coming from a Rocket uh, member. Thank you. Chimera. Okay, I don't remember if Spark will deal a lot of damage to you. Let's try it out. Yeah, he's ground, so it doesn't affect him. So, against you, can Alexis deal a lot of damage? Wow! My voice cracked there, it's super effective and nearly took him down in one! Wow! <laughs> okay, awesome work, Alexis, taking down Chimera like that. And Jinzo is now level 25. Trying to learn Light Screen, but no, I will not learn that. 
Sword Stalker again. Um, so you know what? I will give you to our Jinzo. Maybe Jinzo can take down opponents now. So let's see him in action. Oh, Confusion doesn't affect Sword Stalker. And Ember is super effective against us. Wow, that's a very bad matchup for you, Jinzo. Sorry about that. Okay, our attack rose, but unfortunately, he's gonna use Moonlight and recover. Well, that's unfortunate. You know what? I would like you to survive, Jinzo. So I will give this to Kuzuhamon again. <laughs> Kuzuhamon is still our Dark Slayer here. So use Moonlight all you want, kind sir. You have no chance against our Dark Slayer. Yep, no chance at all, kind sir. Illusion Magician, so another target for our Elena, who is nearly full health at the moment, <laughs> thanks to the Shell Bell. Um, I didn't think it would be such a nice addition to our uh, monsters, but now I see its benefits, so yeah, I really like it now. Okay, use light screen all you want, kind sir. Yeah! <laughs> okay, thank you, kind sir. And we have unlocked the resident nurse. You look tired. You should take a quick nap. Okay, I will. Thank you. Don't give up. Yeah, I really like that every time she says it. So, uh, here we need to be level 40 in this building. So, who should we put up front? I think I will put Alexis up front. And uh, let's start facing the trainers, guys. <laughs> so, this is gonna be taking a long time. So... Maybe I will make it this faster unless something interesting happens, so here we go! Aye, 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 aye.
And that is enough for our Alexis to gain a level for level 32. And you know what that means? She's gonna evolve now. Rampart Blaster. Well, this is the first time we see a Rampart Blaster, I think, so... Let's see the sprite. It's actually very nice. How will you do against our Psychic, sir? Or ma'am, because that's the evolution of uh, Burstinatrix. Okay, Ember is super effective. Um, I will use Metal Claw against you. Judgeman. Okay, I will keep our Jinzu in and try to take down Judgeman. Those are two of the of the big five, if you remember, <laughs> the deck masters. Jinzo versus Judgeman. Wow. Okay, and Judgeman stands no chance against Jinzo. That can't be true. Well, what do you know? What is true, kind sir, is that our Alexis is gonna evolve now. Our beautiful Blade Skater is gonna evolve into even the more beautiful. Cyber Blader. Congratulations, your Alexis evolved into Cyber Blader. Wow, let's check her summary and her Pokedex entry as well. That is a very nice sprite, I have to say. <laughs> Ice type, docile nature, and trace, copies special ability. Quick Attack, Ice Punch, Hypnosis, and Psy Beam. Wow, I really like that. And let's read her Pokedex entry as well. Okay, there she is. She is a master on the ice. During the summer, she changes her skates in for rollerblades. Well, that's a nice bit of lore there. I like it. Welcome to the team, Cyberblader. And, uh, wow, you know what I'm going to do right now? I'm actually going to check if we are ready to take down our rival, or do we need to level up some more levels? I mean... We are all at level 35 at the moment. I don't think we're ready yet. So, you know what? I will continue the the leveling up procedure here in this road and maybe on cycling road as well until we become level 40. So, let's continue the session, shall we? A few moments later. What upon and marshmallow? Wow, okay, so I think Marshmallow is gonna be the evolution of Watapon in this ROM hack? Wow, okay. Uh, let's use Spark on you then. Psychic will hit first, of course. It doesn't one-shot him, but Spark will definitely take him down, so awesome work, teamwork there. Okay, Watapon with the rollout. Uh, you know what? I will use Metal Claw against you and Spark. I think that will be sufficient. Indeed it is. Okay, I just wanted to show you uh, Marshmallow and Alexis is now level 33. By the way, I didn't see her in action yet. We lost, didn't we? Yes, you did. So... Let me show you Alexis in action. I forgot to do that before I started the session. So let's face you, kind sir. I'm not into it, but okay, let's go. Sir, I need to showcase my Alexis, so... <laughs> Cyclopean? What is that? Okay, but our Cyberblader is intimidated. No, don't be intimidated, Cyberblader. Instead, use Ice Punch on him. Okay, you made our Alexis paralyzed. I don't appreciate that. 
And that's not very effective against you. Power up punch. And it's super effective against ice type. Okay, our showcasing of, our, of Alexis here is not going according to plan. And she's paralyzed and cannot move. Okay, goes through. And that is enough to take him down in our first encounter using Cyber Blader. Thank you, Alexis. That was a very nice showing of you. Wild Wingman. You know what? I will keep her in. And try to sweep your team with her, kind sir. Oh, but he has a fighting move. To take down our Cyber Blader. How unfortunate. Okay, so against you, I will try out Elena. So let's see if we can take you down, sir. Using Psywave. Ouch. That was a critical hit of critical hits. That was a lot of damage, Wild Wingman. Okay, the Shell Bell activates and restores a little bit of our HP back. But she does not survive the second wing attack, so sorry about that, Elena. And we will give this win to our... Uh, who's the lowest level? Three Days Grace. So we will give this to our Three Days Grace. I knew it! Yeah, our Cyber Blader is a very awesome kind sir, unfortunately you took her down. So now, you know, I'm going to um, return back and heal everyone back at the Poké Center and continue um, this session. So if anything interesting happens, uh, I will slow down to show you. But for now, let the training session begin! Ay, 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 ay.
Okay guys, that was a very long grinding session, <laughs> so let me show you what the team looks like at the moment. Uh, we have levels ranging between 36 and 39, so uh, we have Alexis, uh, our beautiful Cyber Blader, with the moveset of Quick Attack, Ice Punch, Hail, and Psybe. Next is our Jinzo, who is now level 36, the monster, has Confusion, Cut, Metal Claw and Psychic, a very powerful Psychic move, and I provided him with the Twisted Spoon to make it even more powerful. Next is our Ace Monster Kuzuhaman with a moveset of Twin Needle, Giga Drain, Moonlight and Air Slash. Our Elena learned a very powerful move in Shadow Ball, uh, that is a very powerful ghost move, 8100. A shadowy blob is hurled at the foe, may also lower the foe's special defense. So this is very powerful and uh, yeah, very nice addition to your arsenal, Elena. Next is 3 Days Grace with the moveset of Strength, Shockwave, Rock Slide and False Swipe. And last but definitely not least, our XY Dragon, the shiny version. He has Thundershock, Thunderwave, Supersonic and Spark. So with that, I hope that we are ready to take on our rival. I'm not sure of the levels that he has in his team, but uh, we're about to find out. So without further ado, let's do this. What kept you, Don? <laughs> okay, he laughed the same time I laughed. <laughs> the character is sinking there. <laughs> I thought you would turn up if I waited here. I guess Team Rocket slowed you down. Not that I care. I saw you in Saffron, so I decided to see if you got better. Well, yeah, let's duel and find out, shall we? Let's duel! Okay, you start off with a Wing Kuribo. Level 37, so... I reckon his Red Eyes Black Dragon is gonna be level 40. Um, so, against you, we will start with Ice Punch. Okay, decent amount of damage. And he's frozen! Excellent work there! Uh, our Alexis is very, very powerful. It's at 10%. But it, it works this time, so thank you very much, Alexis. And just like that, our first encounter... Ends it with a W. Next is Buster Blader. I think I will switch to our Jinzo. He's level 36 at the moment, but he has twi Twisted Spoon. And I will use Psychic on you. Oh, you're gonna detect that? That's totally fine. Okay, it worked twice in a row now. Can it go through, please? Okay, it goes through this time. Excellent! That is excellent! The Twisted Spoon makes our Psychic Attack very powerful and takes down Buster Blader in one shot. Flame Swordsman. Okay, I think I will give this one to our Three Days Grace. Hit the music! Level 35? Okay, are you going down in levels now? So I will use Rock Slide against you. Okay, nearly took you down in one. That is awesome. Sunny day. Um, that's not good for our... Um, for his ace monster, it's gonna make him more powerful. So that's not good. Flame Swordsman, level 35, but you've done your part in uh, strengthening your ace monster. And our 3 days grace levels up to level 39. Dark Magician Girl. You know what? That is uh, that is for our Elena. So, uh, two witches at it. So, Elena against the evil Dark Magician Girl. And that will leave his ace monster left. Level 36. So, I'm pretty sure we can take her down with Shadow Ball. Okay, that was super effective, and now, for the fight that I've been dreading, it's Red Eyes M. What is Red Eyes M? Um, I, I have a plan for you, sir. I'm going to start with XY Dragon in order to make you paralyzed using Thunder Wave, and then I will switch to our Kuzuhaman so that we have an advantage. <laughs> wow. Okay. His Red Eyes Black Dragon evolved into Red Eyes Metal Dragon. Well, that's not good. 
Yeah, sunny day and infernal blast. Okay, can we at least make you paralyzed? With 4 HP left, XY Dragon persists. <laughs> wow, um, that is very powerful. That is very powerful indeed. Okay, he's paralyzed and cannot move. Excellent work, XY Dragon, come on. Deal more damage, please. Okay, the wing attack is gonna take down our XY Dragon, but you've done a remarkable job there. Thank you very much. And now is the time for our Ace Monster to face you, Red Eyes Metal Dragon. You have a huge advantage against us, so hopefully the paralysis is gonna fall into our hands. And I will use Air Slash against you. Okay, that's not a lot of damage at all. And Infernal Blast goes through. That's not good. Yeah, but she tanks it. She tanks it. So, another Air Slash, I guess. Hopefully that will take you down with a critical hit. No, it does not. But he's paralyzed and cannot move. Come on, Kuzuhaman. If this lands, we're gonna defeat our rival using our Ace Monster. And we do! Wow, that, that, wa that went very, very nicely. <laughs> Thank you, XY Dragon, for this. This is all for you, XY Dragon. Your sacrifice is not gonna be forgotten here. Oh, man. So you are ready for boss. Okay, for boss rocket. <laughs> and um, even though I one-shotted his team at parts, but that Red-Eyes Metal Dragon is really scary. Well done, I'm moving on up and ahead. By checking my Pokédex, I'm starting to see what's strong and how they evolve. Am I a genius or what? I'm going to the Pokémon League to boot out the Elite Four. I'll become the world's most powerful trainer. Don? Well, good luck to ya. Don't sweat it, though. Smell ya. Well, I, I, I hate to give it to you, sir, but uh, you're not the king of games in this game, it's another person. Oh hi, you're not a rocket. You came to save us? Why, thank you. I want you to have this Pokemon for saving us. And we have a Cyber Dragon. I will not give it a nickname. Um, I remember it said a Parrot Dragon, but in fact it was a Cyber Dragon. It was a typing mistake in the previous version. That was funny. It's a Cyber Dragon. It's a very intelligent Pokemon. H has Cyber Dragon ever expressed signs of intelligence in the anime? I don't think so. I mean, it's a machine dragon. So, intelligence? That hasn't been expressed before. Thank you, resident nurse. I'm gonna call her Nurse Joy, so thank you, Nurse Joy. And now, let's see if we can um, keep this rolling and defeat... Oh, we have this guy. Hello there, but, but why do you have a Clefairy with you, sir? Wait, you're not an encounter? I'm an illusion. Oh, so that Clefairy is an illusion blocking the way, okay. So, you know what? I will switch and put Elena up front here. And uh, who do I give the experience share to? It's with our three days grace at the moment. Um... Okay, Kuzuhaman, what? You have the Quick Claw, right? I think I will give you the Scope Lens instead. And for now, I will give Elena the Quick Claw. And the Experience Share? Um, I will keep it on 3 Days Grace. That, that uh, works nicely. <laughs> It's time for the final act, starring none other than me, Arcana. Prepare yourself, or Pandora if you're Japanese. Prepare yourself, for when you lose, you'll be enveloped by the shadows. Let's see who's the true master of Dark Magician. Well, Dark Magician is in the box at the moment. Mimikat, okay. So, let's use Shadow Ball against you. Oh, you're a normal type. Well, not anymore. Um, I'm gonna use Shadow Ball against you, I guess. 
that helped me out a lot, so thank you, Mimikat. <laughs> you were a double agent or something. Petten the Dark Clown. He's a dark type, so I cannot use Elena against that. Um, I will resort to our Jinzo. Let's see if Jinzo can take him on. Wait, psychic type moves do not work on dark types, right? So, I cannot use psychic or confusion, so I will resort to metal claw then. Okay, our uh, mental fortitude goes through. Excellent work, Jinzo. Metronome. And he scratched our Jinzo. Well, I don't appreciate that, uh, kind sir. And we hurt ourselves in confusion. That's not good. Okay, this one goes through. Excellent work, Jinzo. And Patton goes down. Excellent work. Dark Magician. Well, that is Arcanus Ace Monster, so you know. We have Ace Monster ourselves, sir, so Ace Monsters shall clash. Kuzoamon, I summon you against evil Dark Magician. Wow. So in this version, it's not a new dual monster. It's the shiny version of Dark Magician himself. That's why he has the stars. Wow, I like that. So against you, sir, I will use Twin Needle. Excellent work, Kuzumaman! Dark Magic Attack! It hardly phases our Ace Monster, sir, and she will take you down with her Ace Moveset Twin Needle! Illusion Magician. Okay, I think that one is uh, fitting for our Elena. She can take him down. So, so far, you haven't been um, an obstacle in our way, I should say, like our rival was. That Red-Eyes Metal Dragon <laughs> without the help of XY Dragon. Yeah, I highly doubt that our team could have handled that. How could this happen? Well, uh, you didn't believe in, in the heart of the cards enough, sir. Wait, what? Please, Giovanni, spare me! Oh... So that makes the illusion go away. Okay. We have to face you, I guess. Stop right there. Don't you move. Or what? Make me, kind sir. So against you, let's try fly. I think that will be super effective against a grass type. Indeed it is! And nearly took you down in one. Leech Seed, I remember that. <clears throat> yeah, I'm not gonna say Elena was seeded because that sounds wrong. Um, I will use Fly again. And that was enough to take you down. Awesome work, Elena. Launcher Spider. Um, since you're a spider, I will give you to our Alexis. Wait, he has fire. So was that the best move here? No, he's fire, so he's gonna be super effective against us. Yeah. Okay, that's not good. Okay, but we have the Shell Bell to restore some HP back, so um, hopefully that will counteract the Will-O-Wisp. 
Wow, her speed fell. Okay, and he hurt himself in his confusion, that's excellent. And I think a, a quick attack shall take you down here, kind sir. Despite the type of vintage, he did not use a fire move, so thank you for that, Launcher Spider. And Three Days Grace is now level 40. Cyber Twin Dragon. Wow, this, this bodyguard of Giovanni has Cyber Twin Dragon. Um, Ground-type moves. We don't have any ground-type moves. I don't think so. So, you know what? I will give that to our Jinzo. Wow, that is a very nice sprite. So, let's see if Psychic will deal a lot of damage here. It's not very effective, but the Twisted Spoon make it... Very powerful to take down half of his health. Man, I really love the fact that we have a Jinzo that just defeated a twin cyber dragon. <laughs> that, that's awesome. Don't! Please! Yeah. Do you know what Jinzo did in GX kind, sir? You, you don't want that to happen to you. So, uh, now that the door is opened, I will go back and heal up before we go for the final battle of this video, Mr. Giovanni himself. So, do I have a plan for Mr. Giovanni? Um, not really. I think he will have Cyber and Dragon with him, so... Who should we lead with? Someone who's strong against Thunder? So maybe XY Dragon will lead with that? You know what? I will. So XY Dragon will go up front, and let's see what we can do against Mr. Giovanni. Ah, Dawn! So we meet again. The President and I are discussing a vital business proposition. Keep your nose out of grown-up matters, will ya? Or experience a world of pain. Let's duel, Mr. Giovanni. Disgordius? A shiny Disgordius? Okay, uh... You know, I don't, I'm not sure if that's your ace monster or not, so... I, I need the Dark Slayer here, so... Kuzoman, I need you, please. Necro Valley. Gravekeeper deck. Kuzoman can't escape. I wasn't willing to, kind sir. Okay, another one shall take him down. Okay, we can tank that, so Kuzoman, take his shiny Disgardius down! That that was a very scary encounter, because our XY Dragon could have been trapped there, <laughs> in Necro Valley. Silent Magician level 8. I will give that to our Elena, she's level 40 at the moment. No, 3 Days Grace is level 40, Elena is about to. So let's see her. Silent Magician level 8. I think this is the first time we see her. Okay, very nice sprite. And I will use Shadow Ball against you. Wow. Okay, goes down in one. Awesome work, Elena. Vorse Raider, another dark monster. So Kuzuhaman, I summon you.
Wow, a critical hit! Nice work, Kuzohaman! And he's poisoned, uh, just to rub it in, so... Night Slash. Wow, okay, that dealt a lot of damage there, sir. I don't appreciate that. So I'm gonna take you down with a Giga Drain to gain back some HP. It's not gonna be a lot, but for the next encounter. Cyber and Dragon. So this is the ace monster you have here, sir. So you know what? I will keep our Kazuhaman in. And let's see how we will do against your ace monster. Cyber and Dragon. And he looks glorious at level 40. So let's start by using Air Slash. Or not, because you took down our Kazuhaman in one shot. Okay, um, that is a very powerful monster, so you know what, same strategy as before. Can you get paralyzed, kind sir? Let's see if that will work. Okay, it works. So now you are paralyzed, kind sir, that is awesome. And let's switch now to someone who can deal a lot of damage to you. I think I will use Jinzo for this, using his psychic ability. So he took down <laughs> twin cyber dragon. Let's see if he's strong enough to take cyber and dragon down. Yeah, that's not very effective, kind sir. How about this? Wow, it's not very effective back at you. But his special defense fell. And he waits his turn due to paralysis, so... Everything is working out greatly right now. Okay, you have another Metal Claw that's not gonna be effective against our Jinzo, sir. Ha! Huh. Wow, that is a lot of damage. Huh, not very effective. Sir, there is nothing you can do to our Jinzo. Finish him off, Jinzo! A critical hit just to rub it in. Jinzo destroys Cyber and Drag. <laughs> awesome work there, Jinzo. The monster that you are. And his last monster is Barrel Dragon. So you know what? I, I like the strategy of using uh, XY Dragon to take him down, but I will change it now. Let's put Alexis up front and see if she can deal a lot of damage to Barrel Dragon. I, I mean, we have it in the bag. Uh, wow, that is a very nice pride. Okay, let's use Ice Punch against you, sir. Try to get you frozen. Let it go. Not very effective, okay. You miss your attack, and uh, I think that's for the better. So, will Psybeam deal a lot of damage? No. Okay, the Shell Bell will heal a little bit back, but maybe Quick Claw will deal a lot of damage here. Wow! Okay, that's not good. And that's not good either. Okay, you know what? I don't want our Alexis to go down here. So I will switch to our 3 Days Grace. We haven't seen him in this fight yet. So, 3 Days Grace, hit the field! And against you, sir, I will use... Let's use Shockwave. Let's see if that will deal a lot of damage. Okay, a decent amount. I will try Strength next. Maybe that will be enough to take you down. Well, it's not. Shockwave seems to be doing more damage to you, sir. Wow, 1 HP left. So, 3 days grace. Try to take him down with this one, Shockwave! Wow, he survives the dough! How unfortunate, Three Days Grace! Well, um, I will give that victory to our Alexis. She can come here and claim this victory. 
using her ice punch. And gain some HP in the process. <laughs> that that is just to rub it in. So, Alexis is now level 38. That is awesome. And we have just defeated Boss Giovanni, guys. We have freed Silvko. Ah, I lost again. And I hate to break it to you, sir, but I'm going to meet you again in the 8th gym. But actually, no, we're not. Because I just remembered who the 8th gym leader is, so... Yeah, this is basically the last time we will duel Giovanni. 4,000! That's a lot of money, thank you, sir. Blast it all! You ruined our plans for self! But Team Rocket will never fall. Don, never forget that all Pokémon exist for Team Rocket. I must go, but I shall return. I'll be back, as the Terminator would say. Oh, dear girl, thank you for saving Silphco! I will never forget you saved us in our moment of peril. I have to thank you in some way. Because I'm rich, I can give you anything. Here, maybe this will do. Do you have Injection Fairy Lily? Shiny version kind, sir? No, you have a Master Ball. Okay. You can't buy that anywhere. It's our secret prototype Master Ball. It will catch any Pokemon without fail. You should be quiet about using it, though. Okay, but thank you very much, uh, dear sir. Do I have an escape rope? I believe I've picked one up. Okay, there it is. We have five of them. And that means that the town is now free again from the rockets uh, uh, and they leave. So that's excellent. Yeah, Team Rocket is gone. It's safe to go out again. Yes, it is, kind sir. And... Hopefully that means that the gym is now open, is it? I think so. You beat Team Rocket all alone? That's amazing! Well, thanks, sir. My uncle is, an, is on probation. He's not allowed to use trap cards for six months. Why? How will I stop OTKs? With hand traps. <laughs> I don't like hand traps and I don't use them myself, but I've suffered because of that. So, I saw the rocket boss escaping Sylph's building. And there's the gym. Who's the gym leader? Saffron City Pokemon gym leader, Odeon. Okay, so that's the tale for the next part. For now, I will finish this part at this Poke Center right here, after I heal my awesome team. Um, and who knows, do I change my team before the next part? Because let's face it, the next part I will face the trainers at the gym, then the gym leader, then I will return back to Fushia's gym, face the trainers there, and the leader there. So that's gonna be a lot of experience points, and I'm not sure I wanna waste that. So you know what, I will give a big thought to our team members, and think who I should replace for the next part. Jinzo, you are very powerful at level 36 and the Twisted Spoon makes you very, very powerful. But I think I will add someone in your place next part. So, you have been awesome in this part, all of you. Really, really, all the team has been awesome this part. And you were awesome too for sticking with me on this part. So thank you all, and I will see you next part. Goodbye.